Hey guys, it's Nate, aka The Foot Accountant. Welcome back to the channel. You, you guys know what we got today. We got the new upgrades in FIFA 19 Ultimate Team. We got the three. They didn't give us just one or two. They gave us three different variations of upgrade SBCs during footies. Now we finally got these. The uh, first batch is only in packs for a couple more days at the time that I'm recording this. And I'm going to talk a little bit about these packs since they're out for a week. They are out for an entire week. And that means you can use them for the first batch and you'll be able to open them during the second batch as well. We're going to talk a little bit about that in a bit. But I want to take a look at each SBC really quick since you guys probably already know what's going on here. And then we're going to get into opening the packs. I have five of each. It's not a ton, but it's just a few. I just rinsed my club and we were able to do five of each. So the first 81 to 86 upgrade looks really good. You only need four players. The rest you can use silvers and bronzes for so this SBC is really really cheap to do and this is perfect for uh, icon crafting and crafting SBCs that could be out in the store like the Firmino SBC and stuff like that and I want to mention one thing about this SBC 81 to 86 upgrade if somebody has a base card like a Sterling right now Sterling has a special card in packs like his uh, the Champions League UCL final card uh, a road to the final card he has an 85 rated base card, so you could technically pack that card out of this pack since the base rating is from 81 to 86. So that's kind of the, the, the bee's knees with this one. That is a sick pack. According to Footbin, it costs you 4,000 coins to do that pack. 82 plus rated guarantee gives you one player that is 82 plus rated base card or special card. All you need is gold players, five rares, 30 chem. That one's okay. It costs about 9,000 coins to complete then the 81 plus double upgrade is 11 gold 11 rare players 40 chemistry but you do get those two players so the 82 plus and the 81 double upgrade i'm kind of like eh on they're just okay but the 81 to 86 is the real crafter's dream uh, because honestly for that 81 to 86 upgrade pack you can just do bronze pack method bpm and you can actually if you do enough bronze packs, you're going to make enough coins that you can use those bronze that don't sell um, in this SBC. And you can also sell the bronzes and use those coins. Like if you get a squad fitness, that enables you to buy two gold cards that you need to put in that, in that SBC. And you need four gold cards and the rest can be whatever rating, whatever type. So the 81 to the 86s are really good. But obviously if these packs don't have good pack weight... They're not going to be any good to do unless you do tons and tons and tons of them. So I want to start off as it goes in order here. We're going to go to the 82 plus packs first. Then we'll go to the 81 double upgrade and then to the 81 to 86. So these are the 82 plus packs. First one, we get an 82 rated card and that is Sigurdsson. So not the best start. So again, I am doing five of these packs, five of each pack, just to kind of compare them and see how we do. I know it's not a huge sample size. Um, it would have been nicer to do 10 of each, but five of each is a decent start. And I want to just be able to show you guys this uh, because uh, these upgrades are going to be very, very good for us in this next week. And that's what I want to make the point of. I'm probably not going to open too many before Wednesday when the second batch of cards comes out. I'm going to be saving most of my packs for these upgrade packs until after that batch two comes out because that batch has a lot more promise than the cards in this first batch do. We finally get a board on our third 82 plus and it is going to be Luis Gustavo 83 rated. So the 82 plus are not looking so hot right now. That's for sure. Um, I'm kind of interested to see how the 81 plus double upgrade compares to the 82 plus because you get two cards. Here we go, a walkout on our fourth 82 plus. This looks like a road to the final. Spanish center back, uh, Nacho Fernandez. All right, so an 82 plus, we get an 87 rated road to the final, Nacho Fernandez. We'll take it, you know? 87 rated card. I already had PK in the club, so I was really hoping not to see that PK uh, walk out because that would be an untradeable duplicate. And I don't want that. But that is a nice pack pull. That's our first walkout and our first special card. Very good for SBCs. He's going to go right into uh, the Maldini SBC, which is what I'm working on at the moment. All right, so last 82 plus. Out of, the, out of five, are we going to get two walkouts or not? Will we get another board? Okay, so we got five packs. We got 
one walkout, two boards, um, an 84, an 83, and two other 82s. So, eh, you know, that's just okay. If you're averaging one walkout per five packs, um, that's honestly not terrible, but um, that's nothing too spectacular as well. They didn't surprise me that much, but we'll see what these other ones get to. These are 81 plus double upgrade. First one's a walkout. Looks like another road to the final. Oh, just kidding. Wants to watch. Who's this? Who's this? Goretzka? Let's go, man. 81 plus double upgrade. The first one we get wants to watch Goretzka. That's a big time pull. Coming out on the Spurs kit as well. We'll take that. That's a pretty solid pull. Anything else? 81 rated Skirtle. So the first 81 plus, we do get a pretty solid pull in wants to watch Goretzka. So off the bat, I'm liking these 81 plus double upgrades. That's for sure. We get boards in our second double upgrade. Can we get like an 85? We get a French center attacking mid. It's going to be Payet. That's an 84. So right away, we're off to a pretty solid start. One walkout, one special card, and an 84 from the 81 plus packs. What are we going to get in pack number three? It's not a walkout. Man, after you see that walkout symbol a couple times, you want to see it every single stinking time. Uh, another French player, goalkeeper, Mandanda. All right, it's an 83. I'm really excited to spam these upgrades, though, after the batch number two comes out. Two 83s, actually, in that pack. Not bad. I'm really excited to see what comes out in batch two. I think there should be tots. There should be headliners. I mean, I feel like EA should have no holding back on this because um, it's the end of the year, right? It is the end of the year, and... What are they going to lose? They're just going to have people enjoy their game more if they put all of those cards back into packs. We're going to get a duplicate Juan Mata. Please tell me this is tradable. It is. We'll throw him on the transfer list. So we got two Manchester United players in that pack right there. Last 81 plus, because so far these have been comparable to the 82s. Very comparable to the 82 plus. It is a board as well. Who's it going to be? French. That's our third French board in a row. Kingsley Coman. Oh, Ribery. We'll take that. 85 rated Ribery. Not too bad. So we got an 85 and 84, the Goretzka, um, and a couple other 82s. So right now I'd say the 81 pluses are winning over the 82 pluses. Let's get into the 81 to 86, which are in theory the least... Uh, you, you have the least amount of chance to get a high level or a high rated card from these unless you hit a special. And we hit Lucas Lieva in the first 81 to 86, which isn't too bad, 83 rated. We will take that. We will send him to the club. Four to go. And these are the perfect ones, again, I mentioned this before, these are the perfect SBCs for crafting. Um, if you're going to do crafting, if you're going to craft icons or if you want to craft the Firmino or maybe one of the footies winners, this is going to allow you to do it for a lot cheaper because you can spam a ton of these packs. You can do 100 of these packs for around 400,000 coins if they cost you 4k a piece. That's ridiculous. 100 packs for 400,000 coins is pretty nuts when it comes to upgrades. Um, you know, 400, 100 packs out of some of the other upgrades that we've had this year, like if you did 100 of the 81 plus packs, that would run you about a million coins because they're 10,000 coins a piece. Um, if you did a hundred of them, uh, that would be, that'd be pretty crazy. That would be pretty crazy. All right. We have two 81 to 86 rated plus players left packs left. Excuse me. Nothing too, nothing too big out of these, but that's kind of what you're going to expect. If you're doing the uh, 81 to 86, you're going to spam these. And I could have told you that it was going to come down to the 81 double upgrade and the 82. It was gonna be between those two packs, personally. Um, but, you know, we gotta try out the 81 to 86 as well and test our luck. We do get another board, so this is our second board. Portugal, CDM, is it gonna be Pereira? It is Danilo Pereira, 83 rated. So two boards out of the five 81 to 86 upgrades. Not terrible, if you're crafting again, that's decent, all right? So, here's my thinking on this. We'll go over to Flippin for this one show you the SBCs again. 10,000 coins for the double upgrade, 4,000 coins for the 81 to 86, and uh, 9K for the 82 plus. I really think that this one, you're gonna get the most consistent. If you're looking for special cards and big pulls, I think your 81 plus double upgrade is gonna be the way to go because you get two cards and they're both 81 plus. 
Yes, it does cost you 10,000 coins, but um, that's going to get you your best chance at a special card, in my opinion. Um, getting walkouts, getting special cards, that's going to be your best chance for that. If you're looking to craft, purely craft SBCs or whatever SBC you want to go for, like this Firmino, the 81 to 86 is the best bang for your buck. Now, especially as we get into this next set of cards, I feel like in this first set of batch one, there are more cards that are in that 81 to 86 rating. In the second set, we might see a few of them that are actually above that rating. So you might get more golds out of this than you would special cards. Um, but this is still going to be great for crafting. You know, you're going to get 84s, 85s, 86s that are perfect for SBCs. And then if you're doing a lot of these, you're going to get some 81s, and from those 81s, you can either put them into the Team of the Week SBC, or you can put them into like an 81 plus double upgrade and use those there. But that is really nice. Again, you can use a lot of these cards that you get from the 81 to 86. If you don't want to craft icons or players, throw them into a tradable 84 plus Team of the Week because these are also out for eight more days. So these are actually going to be in the store when these upgrades go away. So you can use these upgrades to craft just about anything that is in the SBC section right now at the moment. So again, if we're looking for a clear cut winner on this, it really all just depends on what you're going for. The 81 plus double upgrade is gonna give you the best opportunity at packing big time players, special cards that are in packs and all that kind of stuff. And the 81 to 86 upgrade is gonna give you um, the best opportunity at packing a, um, a gold card for you know grinding out the SBCs and stuff like that. But again, a lot of this is really based upon what happens with batch two. Uh, and those cards are going to be coming out here in the next day. So I'm excited for that. I'm going to be stacking a lot of packs. You're probably not going to see me do too many more of these 81 to 86 or other upgrade SBCs. We'll do a few. Um, but uh, I'm going to save most of these SBCs for the next batch of players because I think it could be something special. I think it could be pretty good. And I'm really crossing my fingers. Uh, that we do get something good from the batch too. But again, GGCEA for putting out this content today. Firmino was a solid SBC. It's about half the price, a little bit over half, but still a big time drop in what it was when it was first out uh, a couple weeks ago or during team of the season, maybe about a month ago when that came out. So that's a big time deal from them. GG to EA. And then GG to EA for giving us three different upgrade SBCs. Like, thank you. Uh, I was expecting one, maybe two. And we got three different ones. So Foot Economist, Zaro, Corey, whoever is responsible for this. I think Foot Economist. I think he's watching these videos. He hears me. That's just my take. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. But hey, whoever was responsible for it, thank you very much for putting these out. GG's to you, EA. Uh, it's the end of the game, and you're allowing us to have fun. We really, really appreciate that. Um, yeah, it's going to be really fun the next couple of weeks. Hopefully those upgrade packs get refreshed maybe towards the end of Batch 2 into batch three a little bit because each batch is in packs for two weeks. So hopefully we get upgrade packs again at, at the end on batch three for one last time we can do upgrades if we really want to. I think a lot of people would be uh, looking forward to that. But again, if you enjoyed this video, smash a thumbs up on it, comment down below if you have any questions and subscribe to the channel if you're new. It's been Nate, Foot Accountant. Catch you guys later. Peace out.